All right, guys, are you ready? Because I am. I'm. I, I, I've been ready for about ten years to do this. So here we go. A note from the ja- jackass. No, a note from a note from me. No, this is this is my author's note. Okay. Memory is a strange animal. Like smoke twisting from the tip of a cigarette, it twists and turns, changes shape as it funnels into the night skies. Because when you remember something, you're not really remembering it. What's really happening is that you're remembering your most recent memory of the memory. And that memory is just a memory of the one before that. On and on, like links in a chain, leading all the way back to the actual event. And surely, in a chain that goes back 30 or 40 years, links can twist and break. And in this process, something even more bizarre happens. The blending of memory and imagination. So let me say this right now before we even get started. I purposefully blended my memories with my imagination to write this book. For God's sake. I mean, to put you in the scenes like a fly on the wall, I clearly had to invent dialogue. We all know I didn't carry around a recording device or a a pad and a pencil capturing the colors of the sky, the actual verbatim conversations, or the, the details of Don Rickles' dressing room. But these are my memories, and that's all I have. Perhaps maybe not perfectly real, but it's all I have. I've tried my best to capture the feeling, and to me, that's what's real. That's where the real truth lies. Sometimes you have to lie to get at the real truth. Memories are like smoke.